just recently the um, the trade I took on class 500 right now so this is the detector once it shows uh, it goes like at least 10 candles to expect a spike once it shows here there was a spike over here so once it shows and there was there is a series of crash um, the detector is going to wait for the market to settle before it gets to a certain level before it shows again once it shows there is a spike over here it continues a series of spike at this point uh, market settled again and the detector shows here and it's double crashed at this point uh, it shows here again there was a small crash the small here there was a small crash and finally it shows here there is still another crash and I'm still waiting for uh, the market to settle at a certain point once the detector shows I take another trade and close this one I'm still holding this one because it's an inter trade day I'm holding it for the whole day um, to uh, I think one hour more for the day to close before I close this trade because I really knew crash is going to fall is going to fall because uh, during the day it has buy if you check on the D1 time frame it has buy and it has to fall on uh, getting to the close of the day so I'm still holding this trade but uh, I'm just showing you how the detector works this what the detector here this is another one it's in a repaint you see once it shows it doesn't go again once it shows it doesn't go again once it shows it doesn't go once it shows it doesn't go again so this is how it works once it shows you are expecting a spike within 10 minutes time uh, once it shows it can spike immediately after two candles like this one after two candles a strike this one after two candles a strike you see after this one to after only one candle kind of strike so once it shows you just taking your trip and wait for a maximum of 10 candles for the detector to uh, show once it shows you wait for at least 10 candles uh, to expect a spike 